The early 19th century was a time of rapid growth for Liverpool. The newly developed steam engine was powering an industrial revolution across northern England and in 1830 the world's first passenger railway was opened between Liverpool and Manchester. New and bigger docks were under construction, trade boomed between Britain and all the corners of the world and the population tripled between 1831 and 1891. While many of Liverpool's citizens lived in overcrowded, sometimes squalid conditions, the nouveau rich could afford more luxurious surroundings. In 1800, the corporation surveyor, John Foster Senior, had drawn up plans for an area known as Moss Lake Fields. Situated on the top of St James's Mount, away from the grime of the city centre, the area offered an opportunity to live in spacious comfort. This area is now known as Canning. Over the next hundred years, a succession of developers built a large number of imposing and elegant townhouses, mostly in the Georgian style. The area is now one of Liverpool's conservation areas with a number of listed buildings. This film will provide you with an overview of the demographics and characteristics of Canning while we consider Canning 2025. Thirty-nine point two per cent of LHT tenants are disabled. There are sixteen point six crimes per one thousand of the population. This is compared with ten nationally. One thousand and forty people have moved address in Canning within the last twelve months. This is forty percent of the population here, compared to twelve percent nationally. Twelve percent of people are workless benefit claimants. This compares with nine percent nationally. Eight percent of the stock in Canning is vacant. Welcome to Friendship House. Uh, I'm, my name is Elvira and I work here as a scheme manager. We have uh, 31 tenants here and uh, the scheme was opened in 1988 and by, officially by Princess Diana and uh, I hope you will enjoy it all.
weekly household income is £290. This is compared with 423 nationally. Thirty-three point one per cent of LHT tenants are aged fifty-five or above. The national average is seventeen per cent. LHT target rent collection is ninety-seven point two per cent. We achieve ninety-six point one per cent. In Canning, we achieve ninety-three point one per cent. Since April 2012, 99 LHT tenants needed direct support. 33 of these were outside the box. In Canning, this was 13 cases, with 6 outside the box. Sixty-nine per cent of people in Canning have no car. This compares with 26 per cent nationally. Canning is now over 200 years old. Let's consider the role LHT can play in taking the area forward to the 21st century.